Hi Baker Bears, it's Mr. McGill and I am going to do a screen recording with you to walk you through logging into Google, accessing your Google Classroom, and filling out a daily student engagement survey that you are seeing in your Google Classroom now. If you're on a Chromebook, which many of you are, the screen will look a little bit like this but slightly different. Regardless, everyone will be logging in with Google unless your teacher has given you your clever badge. So I will click log in with Google. For the purpose of today's video, we will use my daughter's account. Her name is Josephine. On a MacBook, the screen will look like this. On your Chromebook, it will just prompt you to put in your username. If you don't know your student username, make sure you let me know or your teacher know and we'll get it to you. Here, we'll put in our password. And click sign in if you're on a Chromebook. It will log you into your Clever account. In Clever, there are a number of resources that you are probably already used to using. There are resources for Envision Math, Pearson, also iReady, and then Typing Tutor for many of you. All of these are icons that your teacher or other folks in the district have put on there so you can use. For the purpose of today's video, you're going to find Google Apps. It, under Google Apps, there's the Google Drive, where you'll be saving all of your files, and then Google Classroom. Students should be clicking on Google Classroom to log in every single day. In here, we'll have all of the classrooms that, that you're a part of. Most students will see their regular teacher, as well as their PE teacher, maybe a technology teacher. So we'll click on Student Engagement for today. And then what you're going to see for most of your classes is that your teacher has posted the daily student engagement forms right on the stream. Stream is this area right here where teachers post um, activities, uh, Zoom meetings, or your schedule for the day. Every day, what we would like you to do is click on a daily student engagement form. When you do that, there will be a field that says student name and a drop down menu. You'll choose your name. Remember to always choose your name, and then you will just be answering three short questions. Did you participate in distance learning class today? Yes. Do you need any more help about an assignment? In this case, no, but if you did need more help, you would click yes, and the teacher would reach out to you. Do you need any other support, like anything at home we can help with? Do you need anybody to talk to beside your teacher? Or do you need help with the technology itself? If you do, you could click yes. In this case, you're going to click no. And then an optional message for the teacher. We'll write, today was a great day. And then the person submitting the form is the person that is turning that in. In this case, it's going to be the student. So I'll click student. And then I'll click submit. That's all you have to do every single day to let your teacher know that you've participated. If you have any questions, make sure to let your teacher know, and I hope this helps.